It's been two weeks. I know. Don't come for me. Don't come for me. It's been two weeks. I know. Don't do it. <laughs> to my vlog make sure you like comment and subscribe um, before you kill me in the comments I know it's been two weeks I know don't come for me don't come for me it's been two weeks I know don't do it <laughs> it's been a lot going on but I promise you this vlog is gonna be really good um, number one I it's just been a lot going on at work I'll say that in all honesty it's just been a lot going on at work and I really just needed to kind of ground myself and get myself together with all my projects but you know not anything like bad or, or anything crazy I've just been trying to get used to this new account that I'm on um, and also just trying to balance my work-life balance situation if that makes sense balance my work work life balance whatever you know what I mean I've been working literally every day from like 7 a.m. until past 10 o'clock at night so pray for your girl it's been ridiculous but anywho there's a lot that we have to cover. Um, first of all, I got my nails done. I'm very happy about them. They look super cute and adorbs. So we're gonna talk about that this week. Uh, I also went to an amazing, historic, beautiful night at Carnegie Hall. I saw DJ D-Nice sold out show at Carnegie Hall. It was the most thrilling, liberating, situation ever shout out to my girl Kimmy for giving me tickets I have all that in here as well there were performances by Jada Kiss from Ashanti from Queen Latifah like Styles P was there like Slick the R Slick Rick was there um everybody you could possibly think of it was just a night full of all the things <laughs> Like all the things. <laughs> so that was amazing. Historic Carnegie Hall. You can't get any more bourgeois than that. And yet we have DJ D Nice who has been holding us down throughout the entire quarantine, giving us life. So I think I'm going to show that first. Um, and then I also went to an amazing dinner with my friend Luke, who has just been really holding me down here where I live and he's like the worst slash best neighbor to ever have because we always find ourselves in these conundrums where we're going to dinner and buying bottles of wine which we should not be doing but should be doing at the same time um so I'm not gonna hold you roll the tape roll the footage roll the footage <laughs>
literally rushing to get my nails done because this is not cute it's not cute it's not cute it's friday um <laughs> say hi to jay he's very upset with me that i'm about to leave but i need to get my nails done it's terrible um i also have a lot of things that i want to do this weekend i want to go out to dinner and all that and this ain't it this isn't it this is not it's not the move it's not the move so I'm rushing to go to the spa, get that done. Also possibly run some errands after that because there's just a lot going on. There's a lot going on, there's a lot going on. Right.
So I'm a huge advocate for taking care of yourself, pampering yourself, doing what needs to be done to make sure that your emotional and mental health is taken care of. So ladies, don't shy away from the the nails and the petties. Every now and then you just need it. It's been like such a roughness. <laughs> I'll call it a roughness at work and I needed to just get a massage, get my nails and my toes done and just feel, you know, feminine, pretty and cute. It's also really good weather. It's Friday and I'm probably going to get dressed up and go out for a drink tonight. Probably do a solo date, do a chit chat, probably let you guys get ready with me. We'll see. But I love the nails. This is cute ombre situation with a little design. And I'm happy about it. So I just finished dinner with uh, Luke. My hair, oh my God. Okay. So I just finished having dinner with uh, Luke. My hair is like totally reverting back. I'm trying to wear it straight during the summertime, which is not always the greatest idea in the world. I'm trying y'all. I'm trying, I'm not looking in the camera because I'm literally trying to get my hair together, but I needed tonight like work has been so stressful. <laughs> the account that I'm on is like, it's a great account, but it's like super as stressful. But we went to this amazing restaurant called Tavern Vernada, I think is it? Something like that, whatever. Um, it's right here on the water and the Hudson, much needed time to just get a drink and get some great food. Um, and then sit on the Hudson and look at the backdrop of New York, which was great. Um, I love Luke. Luke is like a, such a great friend. You know, you always need those friends that you can just grab at the last minute and hang out with them. Um, and I didn't spend too much time on my makeup because it was like literally a last minute ask, but glad that I did go out, needed it. I'm trying to be a little bit more adventurous with when it comes to going out. And I'm trying to also allow myself the space and the ability to be honest when I need a break. And when I need to just do something other than work, because I will work myself to death. I'm one of those people. And I've literally been working until 10 o'clock at night, every single night, which is not fun. Um, but I'm glad that I got an opportunity to go out and see my friend and dress up. And yeah, going home now. Probably to work some more. <laughs>